Hey, so Kibinero, and I was gonna tell you, I was gonna give you an update, a summary actually. I've studied, I've studied a lot of self development material out there. I've read Think and Grow Rich, I've read um, um, Outwitting the Devil, I've read Grow Rich with Peace of Mind, I've read uh, a lot of books, The Power of Positive think Thinking. I've read a lot of books and, and hundreds and hundreds of hours of audio training in self development material. And there's only, uh, and if I could summar, summar up everything that I've learned, and if I just want to give you everything quickly in, um, let's say, five minutes, even one minute, so that you didn't have to go through studying all that, or all that material for yourself. That will save you hundreds and thousands of hours, right? Then it would be this. Uh, for you to get uh, the kind of things that you want to get, uh, you have to formulate uh, a prayer. They say a prayer, or uh, you got to know exactly what you want before you can ask for it. And uh, the only way you will be able to get what you want is through action, right? So you have to take action. Now, if you don't do certain things a certain way, uh, you may take some action, but maybe the actions you take may not may not be the appropriate actions. And uh, and uh, because what is controlling your results and the action that you are taking is deep rooted beliefs in your subconscious mind, right? Deep rooted belief in your subconscious mind. So what you understand is. Uh, your subconscious mind controls almost a lot of the things that happen unless you consciously decide to do certain things that you you choose to do certain things consciously but uh, the order comes directly from the subconscious mind you know something triggers you to do something now for you to be able to get what you want let's say you have a certain goal that you want to achieve let's say a certain number a certain figure amount that you want you have to create a deep deep rooted belief that you can achieve it or that you have already achieved it right so how do you do this and you do this through repetition uh, this is how we've come to believe this is how we've come to learn the things we know this is how we are able to walk uh, is through repetition you do it over and over and over and over and over and over and, over, and then it becomes automatic now what I'm going to suggest to you is that if you know what you want, right? If you know what you want, you got to repeat it to yourself as many times as possible so that it becomes an automatic belief in your subconscious mind, right? And how do you do this? Uh, uh, Napoleon Hill is one of the most successful authors out there. Uh, w. Clement Stone, one of the maybe richest people out there with his company Aon, A -L -A -O -N, which is like a billion dollar company. These are some of the tricks they were using. Actually, the only trick, and the only trick is to get this belief deeply rooted into your subconscious mind so that you start acting automatically. You know, you start doing certain things automatically, you start thinking in a certain way automatically, you start speaking to people in a, automatically in a certain way, and all these small, small things are uh, what is going to lead towards you achieving your goal. So, this is what you should do, and I'm, I'm revealing this because you're on my team, and you may have to pay thousands and thousands of dollars before you come across this stuff. Uh, from the gurus, but I'm not a guru. I'm learning this stuff. So I'm also applying these things. This is what you need to do. You need to record. Maybe you record, or maybe you don't record. Maybe you find another person uh, to do it for you. But you need to uh, to embed these commands uh, in your sub deeply in your subconscious mind. So you need to record something of, I have, uh, I have, you know. One million dollars in my possession by New Year's Eve, the year 2013. Right? I have, have, I have acquired this through blah 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 selling this, this, this and this products. Right? Uh, I have bought maybe my house or whatever. 
and uh, I've improved my relationships, my relationship with my family and whatever, all these things. So you record this clip and uh, and the the easiest way to get this into your subconscious mind is when this, the, 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 the conscious mind is shut down and the best time is when you're sleeping. So you can record this stuff and have it played to you while you're sleeping, right? So you can record this and have it played to you when you are when doing what? When you are sleeping. So do this and it's not, too, it's not something that you just do one day or two days. It's something that you have to do over and over and over and over and over. In, in, in naturally how it happens is that during the day we keep we hearing, we are seeing things. We are hearing, we are seeing things, we are hearing, we are seeing things. So that creates some kind of belief. That is deep rooted in our, in our subconscious mind that is controlling so that our circumstances is constantly the same right constantly the same constantly the same so if you do this it's like a shortcut it's like a shortcut because you, sh you shut off your subconscious your conscious mind and you're going directly into your subconscious mind and the commands are being embedded in your subconscious mind so do this and and see how how how, how it's going to help you out um, it may be dodgy, may look dodgy uh, if you're a religious person, but uh, understanding understanding the laws of nature has never uh, contradicted with the religion. You know, if you understand the laws of nature, you are not contradicting any religion. In fact, any religion should be able to uh, uh, to be is it should be able to be backed up by the laws of nature. And if it's not, then there's something wrong with it. With the interpretation, with most of the cases wrong with the interpretation, some somebody misunderstood something and said something wrongly, and people understand it differently. So, uh, but if it is a true, if it's a true religion, God never makes mistakes, right? God never makes mistakes. Everything is perfect. So, the true religion should tell you that the sun, the earth rotates around the, the sun maybe or maybe some different perspective will tell you something differently which is still which is still true because everything is relative it depends on where you're looking at at it from so this this if you really understand this now i'm telling you, i'm not billionaire or millionaire uh, i'm not uh, but i am the kind of person who's heading towards that direction right and these are the things that are going to get me there so I reveal these things to you if you're on my team uh, so that you don't have to study thousands and thousands of hours before you come up to the same understanding. So take action on that and uh, click on the link below this video also uh, if you're interested to learn some more stuff from me by getting on my newsletter, on my newsletter actually. Uh, peace.